gone too soon, taken by COVID-19. This afternoon, we remember Dearborn Heights Mayor Dan Poletko. Mayor Poletko died late Tuesday from complications associated with COVID-19. The longtime politician was just 70 years old and had a year left in his term as mayor. Nick Monticelli has a closer look at his life legacy and the reaction to his sudden death. Good afternoon. You know, Mayor Paletko served Dearborn Heights since 2004 as their mayor, but didn't have to. He chose a life of public service, even having a good paying job in the private sector. We've also now learned that he didn't spend much time in the hospital. He was only in there since Monday. Hello, I'm Mayor Dan Paletko. In what could very well be the last recording of Dan Paletko, the mayor wished Dearborn Heights residents happy holidays and shared his thoughts on the year that's been. This has been a year like no other for all of us and the most challenging and difficult in my political career. That video was posted to Facebook on December 17th. His colleagues say just this past Monday, he went into the hospital thinking he had pneumonia. He had gone into the hospital on Monday and for what he thought was uh, pneumonia and had some uh, just minor, minor, minor issues, not even close to thinking it's anything COVID related, only to find out uh, later that night that he had unfortunately COVID and uh, passed away late last night. Paleko was 70 years old and served as the mayor here since his appointment in 2004. He left his post in Michigan's House of Representatives to take over, but before that, he was a longtime member of the Dearborn Heights City Council. Before public service, Paletko worked at Ford, where he was a financial manager. He had degrees from U of M, Wayne State, and the University of Detroit. Councilman Dave Abdullah says the mayor could have stayed in the private sector with a much larger salary. He could have had any job he'd have wanted, intell you know, intellect-wise, but he didn't. He chose to serve the community and serve the city, and he served it very, very humbly. He did some very, very nice things for the city. He ran it professionally. He ran it well and he ran it with his all. He gave it his all. Paletko leaves behind two daughters, both in their 30s. I'm Nick Monticelli, Local 4. Thank you, Nick. Now, due to the untimely passing of Mayor Paletko, the city of Dearborn Heights will swear in a new mayor. We have video here, brand new, from where it will happen. Preparations are already underway, and we will be monitoring that and we'll update you on later editions of Local 4 News.